was then to help us get product information from a supplier's catalog. And to do this, we're going to start a new agent from the Granger homepage. And instead of searching for keywords, we're actually going to search for um, search by a Granger item number. And to set that item number, we're going to click in the input field here. And uh, instead of setting a single input, we're going to actually create a list uh, and manually enter that. So I have a list of um, items here that I am going to put in. And uh, then once we've inputted the item, we're actually just going to click on the Go button here to, to, uh, to do the search. Now the page that comes up um, is the the result from the first input that I entered and uh, this is where we're actually going to want to start extracting some information. So we will first grab the category of the part um, we'll also grab the title Um, the third, we're going to, third thing we're going to get is the description. Um, we'll also get the price. We'll get the manufacturer. And uh, finally we'll get the manufacturer's model number. And then we just need to go and save our agent. And we will log into the back end. into the data dashboard here. Um, under the Agents tab, we should be able to see the new Granger SKUs agent. We'll come in, set that to run, and then in the repositories, we can see a new um, Granger SKUs repository that's been created. And by clicking on that, we can see the data as it's coming in. And that is how you would build a product, uh, a supplier catalog script in under three minutes.